Alright guys, welcome back to a new video. Today I want to show you guys how you can design a clean style commission sheet in Photopea. So, Photopea is a free alternative to Photoshop, which you can use in your browser. So, if you guys want to follow along, um, here it is. Check out our store, gfxcomment.com. We have so many assets for you to choose from. Unlimited access right here. Get access as you can see. So let's get right into it. We're gonna go for new project. We're gonna go 1920 by 1080 DPI 300. Oops. We're gonna hit create. Okay, so this is our reference. This is Capdide's commission sheet. So all credits go to Capdide for the idea and this design i'm just here to educate and hopefully you guys learn something from this video and you're gonna want to hit new layer and we're going to choose a color i am going to use orange and you can use any color you want right here so orange i'm gonna hit alt backspace this is going to fill our layer i'm gonna go on google and look for liquid abstract wallpaper now, um, Unsplash lets you use these for free, so I would recommend uh, using Unsplash. Edit and paste right in here. I'm gonna take this and change the mode to overlay. Lower the opacity to go 20. Make, I'm going to make a new layer. Change my color back to black and all backspace. I'm using this. It's like a little screen. So I'm gonna go for the text tool, use the font, enter, and we're just going to type our main text. Uh, change the font weight right here. I'm gonna place this like so. Now uh, just use the sizing options on the actual text right here. So here it is. We're going to change we're going to adjust the color to our orange. Make sure it looks right here. Um, okay, now I'm gonna copy this text. If you hold Alt and drag this down, this will make a copy. Commissions, and make this white and increase the size. Like so, it's probably a little big. Make this a little smaller. Right here is fine. Uh, new layer. Take a rectangle tool, color white, and I'm just gonna make a nice little divider line that goes across right here. Make this opacity 15 or so. Now we're gonna make the panels where your work is is going to be showcased. So new layer. We're gonna take a rectangle corner radius, bump this up to five, use a ruler, place it right here, as well as right here. And then I'm basically going to uh, create a rectangle, like so. We can adjust the sizing further. Oops. Um. I'll say this is fun. I'm gonna copy this over and take both. Make sure it is proportional. Okay, this looks good to me. All right, so now I'm going to bring some work in. I'm going to resize this and right click, find the shape. This one, right click and hit clipping mask. Like so, resize further. Right click and hit blending options. Stroke, color white, and lower the opacity. Like this. And right hit OK, and I'm going to copy this thing over. So we're using the same setup. Delete on this thing. Take this, right click and hit mask. 
we can also resize this thing. We can uh, control click, control G to group and copy these two. Boom, and down here. Okay, so now we're going to make the card design right here. So new layer, rectangle tool, uh, the radius 35. Hopefully this works. Uh, perhaps a little more, 45, and we're just gonna go for a nice card. And I'm just gonna copy this. Control, Control Alt T, resize this up, and go for fill off, and add a stroke at two pixels. So we have this thing, corner radius 65. Okay, that's better. Alright, cool. Alright, we're going to hide this layer, make a new one, control click to make a selection. And you can see right here, we're going to take our brush tool actually, just copy my settings, use the orange color, and go ahead and just paint up here. Change the color of this thing, so stroke orange. And for our text, I'm just going to copy my text from before ultra package okay or right, now for the button uh pretty self-explanatory try to get this right 15 boom and change the color to orange i'm gonna grab this icon eraser background a magic eraser tool I'm going to move that we're gonna copy the color here control click alt backspace control d and this will go right here i apologize if i'm going slightly fast trying to explain as best as I possibly can. Highest quality UI, medium, and color white. Center, any design style. All right, that is basically it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe to stay tuned for more. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.